Hello, Curious! Who remembers Honey Boo Boo, the cheeky, loud mouth and confident star of Toddlers and Tiaras? Well, that is an image that the 16-year-old Alana Thompson has been trying to shake for a long while, and many would think that spending your childhood in front of the cameras would be fun for this teen, but it had some consequences that followed her later in life, which is what she had opened up about in a recent interview with Teen Vogue. Just how did she show it affected her life, and why does she struggle to make friends? What assumptions do people make about her, and what hopes does Alana have for her future? Stay with us until the very end to find out what exactly the reality star said in a tell-all interview, but before we continue, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and turn on the notifications so that you don't miss any of our future videos that we publish daily. Of course, most viewers have and still do see Thompson as this little kid with pitchy catchphrases that burst onto our screens when she appeared on the TLC's Toddlers and Chiars in 2012. Though with an introduction like this, who could forget the public's fondness of the six-year-old meant that she and Mama June and the rest of her family later got their own reality show, Comes Here Comes Honey Boo Boo, which had many people call the family tacky or white trash. And that is how many people had remembered her as, which is something that the 16-year-old is very much aware of. Right now, the teen still is a reality star, but the focus has shifted more onto her mother and her family as a whole rather than just her. And certainly June's problems with illicit substances as well as an ex did not help the way the public perceived the family. And it also created problems within the family, which Alana talked about in an interview saying that previously they used to be together all the time, but after her mom's use of illicit substances worsened, it was like the family broke apart. And Thompson, who lives with her sister Pumpkin and her family, said that, and we hear, quote, a lot of folks in this world World do not realize how many people are actually really affected by drug and alcohol use. It's very, very hard. It's something I'd wish on nobody for real. Though right now, she and Mama June are working on getting back on track, and overall the teen feels proud of how far she has come herself. And if you want to know more about June's problems, then be sure to check out our previous video by clicking on the link above. Being a teenager also comes with its own set of problems, don't you think, Curious? And this is something that Alana has to go through herself. However, having been in the spotlight, those issues are a little bit more amplified for her. And she also revealed that because of this, people still view her as a six-year-old child, and they often comment on her social media about things that they do not like about her, such as the way she looks, her nails, or her lashes. And But that's something that she does not care about, as she likes herself and it makes her feel really good. And when it comes to the way she looks, it's also worth mentioning that since she was a child, because of her weight, no part of her body was left unscrutinized, because body shaming is something that most people deal with at least once in their lives, and it's certainly not a pleasant experience. Though, for those in the public eye, it is undoubtedly worse, especially since comments about her body are something that Thompson deals with with her social media comments, like, all the time, probably. And speaking with Teen Vogue, she said, I feel like my generation is probably making it worse. Everybody's all about body positivity well, body positivity until they see a body they don't like. Though, she adds that, looking at herself, she feels like she has a banging body and that she is so beautiful, and she doesn't care about the opinions of others. But body image aside, let's focus on other typical teens, such as her friends. Now, you would think that someone like Lana would have plenty of them, right? But she herself has said in an interview that she doesn't have many, and adding that probably her only friend is her boyfriend. And her reasons being is that she doesn't trust anybody. But Thompson says that she has a good reason for this. And usually, when she starts talking to someone, she tests them over three or four months, and her explanation for this is that she watches whether they call her Honey Boo Boo or whether they offer to pay for anything or just assume that she will since they reckon that she is rich, which she says isn't exactly true. However, if there is one person that she always relies on, it is her sister Pumpkin, as well as her daughter Ella. And given that she currently lives with them, Thompson revealed that they have fun by watching late night movies together, but that she is aware that her living with her sister is putting on more stress on Pumpkin, as there is another person besides her own family, and that she has to worry about that and look after, which is why she has big plans the moment she turns 18. So stay with us until the end to find out what they are. Unlike some other stars, Alana has been a candid about her work on reality TV, saying that to her, it's not just a personal choice as she feels like it is a smart financial decision because she wouldn't make as much money working a regular job. And while she doesn't plan to spend the rest of her life in front of a camera, she plans to continue for now so that one day she can support her own kids if she ever has any. 
And with this outlook into the future, what are the reality star's plans for that? She revealed that she has been working really hard to get straight A's so that she can graduate high school and go to college, and she plans to become a neonatal nurse. So she also has plans to move out once she's 18 and buy her own house, but before that, a car. And thinking long term, she also revealed that she plans to work through college, though Elena did not specify if that meant in reality TV or a regular job, and all because she already is worried about student debt. So curious, you can already tell that this teen reality star is already thinking about her future as well as trying to shed the image of Honey Boo Boo. So what are your thoughts about her candid interview? Do you think that being famous because of toddlers and tiaras would cause a problem for her later in life? And what do you think about her plans for the future? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below and as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Until next time!